chicken heads dropping from the sky. What's that about? Since the 1930s, a rabies epidemic had been sweeping across wildlife populations in Europe. This was bad news since rabies can spread to pets and then to humans. It attacks the brain and leads to symptoms like confusion, aggression and paralysis. Once you got it back then, the infection was 100% deadly. The epidemic had to be stopped. The main carriers of the virus were red foxes, which were now hunted excessively either with rifles or by releasing poisonous gas into their burrows. But it soon became clear that this was counterproductive. Hunting caused the fox populations to migrate, spreading the virus even further. Catching foxes alive and vaccinating them one by one proved too slow and expensive. Finally, in 1978, a somewhat bonkers idea was tested. Blisters filled with the vaccine were put into thousands of chicken heads that were left over from slaughterhouses. They were then tossed onto pathways and roadsides and dropped from helicopters in areas that were more difficult to access. The method worked. Up until 1991, vaccinated chicken heads were distributed in Europe over a total area larger than 330,000 football fields. And as chicken heads dropped, so did the numbers for rabies cases in Europe. Since the early 90s, several countries have even been declared rabies-free. The method is still used today. In 2021, rabies vaccine baits intended for raccoons were dropped from helicopters over Cape Cod, although nowadays, industrially manufactured baits are used instead of chicken heads, which works but is way less interesting than foxes munching on